Hi, this is Julian for Production Expert. In this video, I want to show you some of the things that you can do using this area of the Pro Tools UI, the tracks list. This is really useful for kind of like top level access to your session. So if you're zoomed in close on other things, you, you can get to the whole session from over here. And there's some useful things that you can do. Something to be aware of, though, is that uh, unlike some DOWs, there's a kind of like a one to one relationship between what you see in the tracks list and what you see in the edit window and what you see in the mix window. Now, something you're probably aware of is that uh, you can show and hide tracks from here. You can do that just by right clicking on a track header and going hide for example, but if you click on this dot here, you can hide, and if you click on it again, you can show. And you can very quickly do this to whole ranges of tracks within your session. So, for example, if I hold Shift down here, I can select all of these. I hold Command, I can select a couple of others. Also, you can come over here and you get this kind of crosshairs, and you can lasso ranges. So if I were to hold Command to add these to the current selection, I can select a whole range over here. And uh, yeah, there we go. We have selected a range of tracks from the tracks list. Something else that you can do is you can use this to navigate your session. And that, this is really useful. What you do on a Mac is you hold Control and Shift on a PC. That would be Start and Shift. And any track you click on in the tracks list, you'll navigate to in the uh, Edit or Mix window, like so. which is worth the price of entry on its own. The tracks list is a really useful place to control folders from. Now, folder tracks are containers for other tracks to, to live within an organization. They're very useful. For example, in here, I've got a, a ton of stuff. And if I click up here, I can hide those member tracks and just get an overview up here in this lane. And if I click on here again, I can show them again. But you can do the same thing from here, and it's kind of more convenient. So uh, if I wanted to hide the contents of that folder I was on there, if I click this disclosure triangle, I can hide them, I can bring them back. We can add a couple of modifiers to make that more usable as well. For example, if I want to put everything away, if I just add Option, Alt on a PC, I can close all of my folders, the same for opening them all. There we go, and I can unfold the whole folder structure. If I only want to do a couple, say the drums and uh, if I hold command, the electric guitars, if I just select these two and then hold option and shift, it'll just close those ones. And uh, if I had some folders within other folders, nested series of folders, then if you add option and command or uh, alt and control on a PC, then you can fold down the entire folder structure from that point downwards in the, in the folder tree, if you like. There are lots of other things you can do with the tracks list, but uh, if you weren't already aware of them, those four things, showing and hiding, scrolling tracks into view, selecting groups of tracks, and controlling the toggling of folder tracks is a great way to kickstart your session management in Pro Tools. I hope you found that useful.